Coffee House, a place where the love for performing arts unites us. A place to laugh, a place to cry, a place for friendship, passion, creativity, inspiration, new talent, safety. A place where, where students can be themselves, a place where you aren't judged, a place where you don't have to hide, a place where someone is by your side, family. A place where we are in harmony, a place that ignites, where we begin our journey. This is your coffee house. Good morning, Bison. I'm Isabella Sanchez. Today is Tuesday, October 31st, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Teaching Academy, the Volleyball Regionals, and more. Our TV news starts right now. With over 100 students, the Teaching Academy at Ronald Reagan Senior High School teaches students to become future educators. Teaching Academy is a four-year program partnered with Florida International University for students to learn and participate in dual enrollment courses in the field of education. Yesterday, students had a meeting with Maximo Alvarez, founder and president of Sunshine Gasoline Distributors, Inc., and Marco Osorio, business consultant of Chevron Gasoline Station, about Chevron's Fuel Your School program. This program, founded by Alvarez, helps make a difference in communities like ours by helping fund materials and supplies for local public schools. Following Alvarez's sentimental speech and testimony, the Teaching Academy was rewarded with $1,000 by Chevron's Fuel Your School program. The program also donated to the school another $1,000. Photography Club will have a meeting next week, Thursday, November 2nd in room 178. The $15 club fee will be collected. Don't forget to bring your artwork to the National Art Honor Society meeting on November 3rd. Remember to buy your yearbook for $60 in the Media Center. There will be an FBLA meeting after school Thursday in room 101. And don't forget that today is the beginning of the second nine weeks. Thank you for watching and remember to follow us on Instagram at RTV News and tune in every week for your dose of RTV News. Oh,